baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Hey guys, it's Sharika, and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. So today I would like to start the video off by saying thank you to Sunbur Hair for sponsoring this video. I'm just gonna add a few clips in on me getting the hair prepared for an install and then I'll meet you guys back here. So I did dye the hair, I let it air dry here. I'm just checking for shedding. This unit does come with three combs, one on each side of the unit and one in the back, along with your lace tabs and your adjustable straps. The hair was pretty easy to straighten. It took the dye well. The hair is nice and flowy and soft. Okay, y'all, and this is how the hair turned out. I'm gonna get a little closer so you guys can see this texture on the hair. It's so nice. I did dye it using my texture and tone. And you guys probably noticed when I showed the inside of the unit that I got a little bit of dye on the lace. But it's okay because I always use foundation on my lace, so it always works out for me. I usually don't bleach my knots. And this is how mine turned out. It's so beautiful, nice, soft, and silky. Like, look at this hair. Like, look at it. You guys need this. I need more of this hair, okay? So, Sumber Hair, send me more, please, because I need more of this hair. This hair is gorgeous. And this is how long it is on me. Y'all know I am 5'4". Gorgeous hair. I love it. So I have all the information along with the discount code in the description box below. Okay y'all, so I know that I'm gonna get a few questions of the dress that I'm wearing. I actually found this dress on Amazon. I wanna get it in the purple and the green, um, but they didn't have my size available, so I'm gonna go back on the site today, but I will have it linked in the description box below. All right y'all, so I'm getting ready to go have lunch with my friend. Um, I don't think I'm going to pick up the camera because everybody don't like being on YouTube, so I ain't trying to do that. These are my Louis Vuitton shades, you know, that I got for my birthday in November. Uh, what purse am I going to carry? I might carry my Louis Vuitton. I'm really wanting to do a clutch. This is what I'm carrying, so um, I might pick up the camera to show you guys what I'm eating, but I probably won't vlog while we're there because everybody don't like to be on camera, so I hate to be that girl. <laughs> so um, I'll see y'all later. Today is Wednesday and I am on my way to run a few errands. I need to go to the grocery store because I want to get some stuff for a hard shell taco. I told you guys that I've been like craving hard shell tacos lately. We went to the taco truck on the last vlog and I 
thought that they were going to have hard shell tacos but they didn't so i just said you know what i'm gonna make my own hard shell tacos i can do them exactly how i want to do them at the house so that's what i'm gonna do so i need to do that it's early release so i only have a couple of hours before i have to go pick up my son i'm gonna go to the p.o box um what else do i need to do i want to stop by lowe's and i might go to um home goods just to see what they have I need to get a car mount, but I'm going to order one from Amazon because I always vlog with my phone when I'm in my car. And, oh, and I got to stop and get gas. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, this banana nut bread from Sprouts. Bomb. I like to get the banana nut bread at Starbucks, but y'all know I don't really go to Starbucks that much because I like to make my coffee at home. But this right here. Bomb. talking about the green black opium this is the name of it so I'm gonna smell this I have this one so ready for these tacos i need to get like something that i can eat in the car because i am starving i didn't have anything but that fruit this morning i'm gonna park right here right in the front but i might get like a little sandwich or something oh come on over the hump this lady will close her door and park All right, I'm gonna run a Trader Joe's. It's 1:43. Run in here a little bit, browse, get my bacon, get my probably get my egg rolls. Just get the normal stuff that I always get from Trader Joe's. I ain't gonna show y'all because I always get the exact same thing every time I come. So I'm gonna run in here real quick, grab this stuff, and then pick up my son, and then we're gonna go home and make some tacos. So let's go. So I'm back in the house. Tell me why I forgot the bacon from Trader Joe's. That was the whole purpose of me going to Trader Joe's was for the, the bacon. And I forgot the bacon. So I'm going to Home Goods tomorrow. So I'll just go up there and pick up some bacon. But I did try a few different things because every time I go to Trader Joe's, somebody always tell me, try this, try that. And I always forget. But I grabbed... I think like three different things, three new things. So I'm gonna just show y'all everything I picked up. Savory crackers, vegetable fried rice, garlic naan, fancy cheese crunchies, Hatch Valley salsa, salmon burgers, shrimp burgers, chicken strips, vegetable rolls, tempura cauliflower, spinach artichoke, and buffalo chicken dip. I've never tried these tempura cauliflower, so I wanna try these. I hope they're good, cause that would be fun. I've never tried the vegetable fried rice. Y'all know I like to get the Japanese fried rice because it's so bomb, but my son don't really like that one. So 
I grabbed this one for him really and then I'm not too sure if I tried this one before but I I don't think I have so this is new for me I used to get these all the time so it's been a while um, and then I'm also trying for the first time the buffalo style chicken dip so I'll see oh and this I've never tried this before so I'll let you guys know what I think but I love Trader Joe's frozen section but I always get the exact same thing y'all know that this is like my favorite I love to eat this with like soups and one of you guys told me because you guys know that I love making pizza at home and one of you guys told me to try this when I make my pizza so I'm gonna do that because I love this stuff y'all know I buy it all the time yeah, and I'm probably late, but I did not know that Dr. Teal's had the stress relief body scrub. So I grabbed some of this. I didn't smell this one, but they also had this one. I mean, I thought I bought three. I did. And I grabbed the black elderberry. This one smells really, really good. This one has shea butter, orange oil, and avocado oil. This one smells amazing. Taco stuff. I just got the basic stuff. This is my first time buying this creamy Baja sauce because y'all know I'm a sauce girl. So I'm going to try this creamy Baja sauce from Taco Bell and see if I like it. So wish me luck on that. And these are the taco shells that I like to get the standing stuff. You can get, you know, all of your ingredients in these. So I really like these. These are the ones that we get for my son because he liked the little bowls little tortilla bowls so that's what we get for him and this is the meat that I'll be using so this is just the ground turkey breast and that's what I'm gonna use to make my tacos with I forgot to show y'all <laughs> what I got from world market so I got a um, roller what is the proper name for this a pin roller is it a pin roller? I think so pin roller but as soon as I saw this, I thought about Brooke because I watched one of her vlogs and her, and her husband was making a pizza and they didn't have a pan roller to roll out that dough. And baby, they had me cracking up in there. Y'all know she's so silly. So she had me cracking up. She used everything she could. They made it work. Y'all know we'll, fi we'll figure that thing out. But I needed one also because y'all know I love making pizza at home. I haven't made one in a while, but... I needed one so I bought this one I thought this was really different from what you would normally see but it's so pretty so it has the thinner things there and you just roll 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 and then I also forgot to show y'all that I picked up some falafel from Trader Joe's this is my first time trying their falafel but I love falafel I used to eat it all the time I used to get like the falafel um, sandwich it's like a veggie sandwich and you just put the falafel because this is not meat. So it's like a vegan meal. And we do the lettuce, tomato, and then I don't I can't remember the name of that sauce that they used to put on it. Um I can't remember what it was, but it was so good. So I'm gonna try to do that. I'm sure I can find a recipe on Pinterest, but I love falafel. These are fully cooked. So really good so I was so excited when I saw these I didn't know they sell these and then from world market I just bought some sparkling water this is the sparkling spring water this is the one that I usually get like if I go to a restaurant or something and they offer um, steel or sparkle I'll get this one and then I bought another one and this one is sugar-free it's a sugar-free sparkling spring water it's the lemon flavor so I got this one so yeah and then of course I bought the eucalyptus for Ryan let's call him I'm gonna tell him that I picked something up for him and y'all right now I'm trying this um buffalo chicken dip it's so spicy it's so spicy I don't do well with spice real spicy we gonna FaceTime Rain. <laughs> yes. You 
go on the block, but not on the block. I'm naked, girl. I'm taking a lunch break. <laughs> Y'all hear him? I got something for you. You said what? I got something for you. No way. Some real strong eucalyptus too. They strong. It had yes, it had my whole car smelling like eucalyptus. I went to um World Market and they had some in there, so I said, let me grab my brother some of these. I love it because you know the lady was telling me she was like they so hard to find in Jacksonville. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I got you some, child. Well, I appreciate you, honey. This uh, this Thrifton Hall. It's thirsting hot. Oh my god. The looks, the looks are looking. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I got the YSL illicit green, the parfum, and I got the 2.5 ounce in this one, and then the one fluid ounce in this one. I just thought that this would be a good summer scent. Y'all know usually I don't um I, I don't really care about all of that. I wear my stuff whenever I want to. But I'm a Florida girl, so I can wear my stuff year round. Ooh, that smells so good. I like this one better than my other um black opium. Ooh, y'all see all my girl. I got a mess over there. Don't look at that stuff. This smells so good. If you guys have not tried this one, try it. I'm not too sure how new it is. Child, I don't need no more perfume. I'm actually thinking about going through um, some of my perfumes that I don't wear and giving them away. This is the YSL Intense. This is probably like, well, this bottle right here is like my favorite perfume bottle. It's just so pretty. I love this bottle so much. Yeah, so this is my first time having this one, the Intense, but let me spray this one up here. And I always forget, y'all tell me not to rub it in, but girl, I be forgetting, child, because I'm so used to doing it. <laughs> mm -hmm. This one does smell better than this one. But I like this one. I think this is my second time buying this one. So yeah, I'm, I have like so many perfumes. I really didn't need these, but, um, oh, I was about to say, why did I buy this when I already have it? But this is mine from out <laughs> But um, I did want to get my hands on this because it's just so good. Like this is so good. I love it. I love this a lot. All right, let me put this stuff up girl so I can make these tacos because I'm hungry. Okay, y'all, so I just finished editing, and girl, I had banana nut bread sauce all over my finger. <laughs> this thing came with like, I think like eight slices. Girl, I got three left. <laughs> I am so ashamed. Listen, get you some banana nut bread from Sprouts. It's so, so good. But Ryan is on his way over here to pick up his eucalyptus. If you girls are like me, I don't really like all of that stuff hanging from my shower. Um, but if you followed me for a while, I've talked about this like years ago that I like to use oils. And what I like to do is just, um, just do a few dabs in my shower and the steam from the hot water We'll just make it smell like a spa and it'll just be amazing okay you can use whatever oils you want i like to use the eucalyptus and rosemary or i'll do lavender just depending on what mood i'm in i don't do it all the time but i do it sometimes when i just really want to relax and just get into my vibe because y'all know i love to pamper she okay all right so here's the tacos they're gonna be so bomb because this sauce right here is my new fave. So good, y'all gotta try it if you haven't already. This one has some guacamole on it. Did I put, I think I put guacamole on this one too. But the way that I do my hard shell tacos, everything is at the bottom, like the meat, the sauce, the cheese, and then I do the lettuce, tomatoes, cilantro, 
to make it taste really fresh and really good. So I finally got my tacos and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.